Welcome back to the channel. This is about money, business, and credit. Today, we're gonna to be talking about how to purchase some products and services for your business without using any credit card. So no utilization on the personal or the business side. Let's get it, baby. On this channel, we talk about how to build credit for your business how to grow your business and how to get funding for your business. I get a lot of entrepreneurs asking me, well, you know, I need business credit cards. I need lines of credit. I need this type of loan. I need that type of loan. I think that those are all good options. And you know, I do help them get all those things. And you can get that by building up personal and business credit. But what you guys didn't know, if there's a lot of credit out there that you guys are overlooking, okay? Now, I've got the link in the description below to some of the hottest reporting net 30 vendor accounts in the game. They report to your business credit reports. They help you build up those reports and help you get easier credit with higher limits in the future. A lot of credit is available to your business without a personal guarantee. And this is in the form of trade accounts. Now, what is a trade account and what is a net 30 vendor account? Well, a trade account is a fancy word for an account that just shows up on your business report. So you're trading, you're doing business with another business. That's called a trade account. That's called a trade line. Now, the very same thing is a, you know, just a regular account that would show up on your personal credit report. But on the business side, we call it a trade account. We call it a trade line. So what is a net 30 vendor account? Well, a net 30 vendor account is when a, a website, um, a vendor, a supplier, anybody that you're doing business with to purchase products and services gives you those products or those services on credit, sends you an invoice, and then you have 30 days within which to pay that invoice. That's called net 30 terms, okay? Now, this is what a lot of you entrepreneurs are overlooking. If you're looking to grow your business, say you're just starting out and you need computers, you need office supplies, you need printing, um, you need to build your credit. Uh, you may need shipping supplies if you're you know, shipping things around, right? Um, you may need furniture. You may need to put gas in your car, in your trucks. As a real estate uh, person or as a real estate investor or maybe you're doing a rehab did you know you can get all that stuff for example uh, paint electrical uh, flooring tiling carpet all on those vendor terms and when you get those accounts they're strictly in your business name you do not need to personally guarantee them you do not need to personally co-sign for them they don't go on a credit card so that's why in this, you know, in the very beginning, I said without using a credit card. So you're saying, you say, well, what's what's the big deal? Why, you know, why can't, why don't I just use a credit card? I can just get a business credit card. Well, even if it's on the business or the personal, it's going to count as utilization. Utilization does affect your personal, obviously. So if you're putting things uh, that are supposed to be in the business name for your business on personal credit cards, well, that usage is going right on your personal credit report. It's affecting your debt to income ratio. So if you're trying to refinance a house, you're trying to get more credit, well, they're gonna look at that debt that's already on there and, and, and figure out if you can afford to get, get more debt. So that's a negative. Now, the next best scenario is if you put it on a business credit card. But even on the business side, it does show up on the business report and it does count as utilization. Why not have zero utilization and really be able to maximize business credit? So you can do that by getting net 
30 vendor accounts from a number of different vendors okay i've got a lot of them in the link in the description below there's a lot of you know layer one layer two accounts you can always schedule a little bit of a call with me that's also in the description and sign up for the most comprehensive business credit building platform on the planet right i'll have more videos about that but all of these resources all of the net 30 vendor accounts all of the gas cards everything that you can buy as far as products and services we've got for you all those links in the description below so the takeaway that i want you guys uh, to get from this video is that there's more than one way to do it don't underestimate those other accounts they do not need a personal credit check they don't show up on your personal report they don't show up on your business credit report right and they're a way for you guys to manage that cash flow if if money is tight in the beginning you're just starting a business you need to get a computer you need to get a desk you need to get shipping supplies stationery, cards you know whatever you need to do don't underestimate those vendor accounts okay so i'm gonna have much more about this here in the future uh, make sure you guys do like subscribe to the channel okay follow me on social media i'm going to be doing a lot more on social media this year it's 2024 and i really want to help you guys to build leverage and understand business credit to the fullest okay i'm not monetizing this channel anymore you're not going to get ads okay i want to give you guys the truth and nothing but even when i lie all right peace and love i'll see you guys in the next one and until then.